Welcome to MRI Cross-Sectional Anatomy, Chapter 4 Practice Questions. There are about 70 questions in this video. Ready? The anterior spinal artery is formed by the union of branches from the A. Basilar artery B. Internal carotid arteries C. Vertebral arteries D. External carotid arteries The answer is C. Vertebral arteries the brachial plexus arises from which ventral rami? A. C4 to C7. B. C5 to C7 and T1 top 3. C. C5 to C8 and T1. D. C3 to C7 and T1. The answer is C. C5 to C8 and T1. The cervical plexus arises from which ventral rami? A. C5 to C7. B. C1 to C4. C. C2 to C5. D. C3 to C7. The answer is B. C1 to C4. The erector spinae muscle group is the chief extensor of the vertebral column and is arranged into which three vertical columns? A. Iliacostalis, longissimus, and splenius. B. Iliacostalis, longissimus, and spinalis. C. Iliacostalis, multifidus, and spinalis. D. Iliacostalis, multifidus, and splenius. The answer is, B, iliacostalis, longissimus, and spinalis, which line points to the odontoid process of C2. A, B, C, or D. The answer is, C. Which line points to the lateral mass of C1? A, B, C, or D. The answer is, B. Which line points to transverse foramen C1? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, A. Which line points to the atlantoaxial joint? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to the spinous process? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to the inferior end plate of L4? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, C. Which line points to the saco promontory? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, B. Which line points to the body of L3? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, a. Which line points to the medial end of the rib? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to the conus medullaris? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, C. Which line points to the thoracic pedicle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, B. Which line points to the costotransverse joint? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, A. Which line points to the spinal cord? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, A. Which line points to the brachial plexus? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, B. Which line points to the right subclavian artery? A, B, C, or D? The answer, C. Which line points to the middle scaling muscle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to the anterior arch of C1? A, B, C or D? The answer is, A. Which line points to the tectorial membrane? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, B. Which line points to the ligamentum nuke? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, C. Which line points to the supraspinous ligament? A, B, C, or D? 
The answer is D. Which line points to the nucleus pulposus? A, B, C, or D? The answer is D. Which line points to the inferior articular process? A, B, C, or D? The answer is B. Which line points to the anterior longitudinal ligament? A, B, C, or D? The answer is C. Which line points to the superior articular process? A, B, C, or D? The answer is C. Which line points to the intervertebral foramen? A, B, C, or D? The answer is D. Which line points to the pedicle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is A. Which line points to the conus medullaris? A, B, C, or D? The answer is A. Which line points to the lamina? A, B, C, or D? The answer is B. Which line points to the costovertebral joint? A, B, C, or D? The answer is A. Which line points to the pedicle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is D. Which line points to the vertebral body? A, B, C, or D? The answer is A. Which line points to the brachial plexus? A, B, C, or D? The answer is C. Which line points to the middle scaling muscle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is D. Which line points to the anterior scaling muscle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is B. Which line points to the cauda equina? A, B, C, or D? The answer, B. Which line points to the base of vertebral vein? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, C. Which line points to the psoas muscle? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to annulus fibrosus? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, A. Which line points to the nucleus pulposus? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, B. Which line points to the spinous process? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, C. Which line points to the zygopophyseal joint? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, D. Which line points to the fecal sac? A, B, C, or D? The answer is, A. The fecal sac or dural sac is the membranous sheath, fecal or tube of dura mater that surrounds the spinal cord and the cauda equina. The fecal sac contains the cerebrospinal fluid which provides nutrients and buoyancy to the spinal cord. The most inferior portion of the spinal cord, located at approximately the level of the T12 to L1, is called the A. Sacral plexus B. Phylum terminale C. Cauda equina D. Conus medullaris The answer is D. Conus medullaris the supraspinous ligament continues into the cervical region as the a. ligamentum nuque, b. longitudinal ligament, c. alar ligament, d. ligamenta flava. The answer is a. ligamentum nuque. The transverse processes of the sacrum join to form the a. sacral promontory, b. cornu, c. lateral masses, d. sacral hiatus. The answer is, C, lateral masses. 
the upper and lower vertebral notches of adjacent vertebrae meet to form the a transverse foramina b intervertebral foramina c central canal d apophyseal joints the answer is b intervertebral foramina where is the dorsal root ganglion located a intervertebral foramen b vertebral foramen c transverse foramen d foramen magnum the answer is a intervertebral foramen which nerve innervates the anterior lower leg a tibial b saphenous c perineal d femoral the answer is b saphenous which of the following are termed the afferent sensory nerve roots a dorsal horns b ventral horns c dorsal roots d spinal nerves the answer is a dorsal horns which of the following muscles consists of several short muscles that are located in the grove between the transverse and spinous processes of the vertebrae a transversospinal muscles b semispinalis muscles c psoas muscles d quadratus lumborum muscles the answer is a transversospinal muscles which of the following veins drain the vertebral bodies? A. Anterior central vein. B. Anterior radicular vein. C. Basovertebral vein. D. Posterior central vein. The answer is C. Basovertebral vein. Which vessels are located in the epidural space of the vertebral column? A. External venous plexus. B. Great radicular vein. C. Internal venous plexus. D. Basovertebral veins. The answer is C. Internal venous plexus. Another name for C1? A. Atlas. B. Axis. C. Odontoid. D. SEM. The answer is A. Atlas. Your first vertebra, C1, also called the atlas, is a ring shaped bone that begins at the base of your skull. Now, let's try to identify the structures in this image. Ready? A is the lumbar plexus. B is the femoral nerve. C is the sacral plexus. D is the inguinal ligament. E the saphenous nerve. F is the sacrum. G is the gluteal nerve. H is the sciatic nerve. I is the posterior femoral cutaneous nerve. J is the perineal nerve. K is the tibial nerve. The arrow points to A, T10, B, T11, C, T12 or D L1 The answer is B T11 Watch this video again Thank you for watching Please subscribe like comment and share